So this is an example of the wet fill technique. First take your brush and fill it relatively full of water. But not so much that you can't control it. Choose the section you want to fill and flood with water. You can see the water moving into the etched lines. That's good. And you want to keep an eye on the sheen of the water. If you see it going over the etched lines, you'll know that that's where it's going to go to. Just go ahead and fill it in. And then you want to give it a second to soak into the paper. You want it to go from a high gloss to a sort of textured sheen before you add your paint. So fill your brush with either prepared concentrated paint or mix it from your pans or whatever whatever you want it's, it's art you can do whatever you want so I've got my brush loaded with cerulean blue my second level color for this painting and it's now soaked into a almost sort of nice sheen and when you add the water and add it in you can see it flows really quickly through those lines. And if you wanted to at this point, you could just direct it into the lines, or you could just fill it like I am here. And there you go, that's the, the wet fill technique in etched watercoloring.